Welcome to Work Smarter TV. I am Martin and in this video I will show you how to calculate percentages. We have our big data set of uh, European, European Union countries with population data for the years 2001 and until 2012. Now this is all a big bunch of numbers that's pretty hard to actually uh, get something out of. So a very good year to, or a very good way to uh, interpret this is to actually calculate the percentage increase from year to year. Um, well, we'll start by uh, the, the easiest day, the way to do this with big data sets is by just creating another uh, worksheet uh, where we will then have in this exact same. Uh, cell configuration, so this is a column with the names and this is a row with the uh, year dates uh, and we can just fill that with a, with handy formulas. So we'll start with creating a new worksheet. You do this here, insert worksheet and we have it sheet 2. Let's just rename this one, we can double click it and rename it percentage increase. So we can always, and this is Population data. You can just double click it and then click somewhere else and it's done. First, we start by copying everything from the first few rows until here. Copy, right mouse button, copy, and then we go to the very first cell and we click paste. Whoa. Yeah, this is what we want. And now we get some funny stuff here. It says 4.84 e point is, uh, plus eight. What it's saying is it says I've got eight more digits and I can't, I don't have any space for them. So it displays it like this. If we select all this and we double click here, it just adjusts the space and then we have regular numbers again. But we don't want these numbers. We want to, to calculate the percentage increases in these cells. So what we'll do is we'll just empty them. Oh. Delete. Yeah, shifts. It, it, so this can be relevant, but it's not now. Because it doesn't matter where they go, it's just whoosh, make them empty. Oh, still trying to calculate stuff here. Don't calculate stuff. Get it out. Oh, yeah, that's what the, the cells here were shifted up there. Um. Okay, so how do we calculate a percentage? If this, let's just do a trial or thing here. This is 100 and this is 110. Oh, 10, sorry. If we want to calculate a percentage, it is the new value minus the old value. It's 10. And then we put brackets around it. <coughs> and then we say divide it by the old value. By the old value. 0 0.1, which is 10%. And then we add this one and it says 10%. That's how basically a percentage works. So now we do this here. So this is the old value. And we're gonna no, let's do sorry, let's just do that. Because this is basically the our the 2001 value will be our 100. Is this minus that one. Put records around it because otherwise it will just divide the second uh, data, the second uh, C5 divided by this one, and we don't want that. And now we create a percentage in it. And that's zero, because it's very small, so we move the comma. Sorry. <laughs> uh, of course, we can't move it that way. Uh, so it's increased uh, for all European countries, European Union countries from 2001 to 2002 is 0.17%. In part two of this video, I will show you how to uh, use this formula and copy it, copy it to the, uh, the entire cell. So watch out for part two. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments. Um, you can subscribe to my YouTube, YouTube channel to get updates. And if you like, you can also click on the link below in the description to my website, WorkSmarterTV. Hope you found this video helpful. See you next time. Bye.